you say to yourself, what the heck is this thing? It's shaped like a surfboard, but it has straps for the feet. It's thin like a water ski, not thick like a surfboard. And the strange thing is, it looks like it's easy to get up on. Well, you're right. It's a little like a surfboard, kind of like a water ski. And when you're up on it, it feels like a cross between skiing, surfing, skateboarding, and snowboarding. The Hyperlite by H.O. The idea for the Hyperlite was conceived in the depths of Herb O'Brien's strange yet fertile mind at the shop, H.O. headquarters in the heart of downtown Redmond, Washington, U.S. of A. A spark was ignited. Herb knew he had the technology to build the best wakeboard in the world, and with this confidence, he got on the phone and he called Hawaii. The phone was to ring on the island of Kauai at the beach at the mouth of the Wailua River, hang out for the world champion of wakeboarding, the slightly demented yet extremely innovative and creative Eric Perez, also known as the Flyin' Hawaiian or Air Perez. Eric and Herb made a deal, and in the months that followed, Eric would hook up with a couple of the hottest surfboard building type dudes on the islands, and together they would conspire to hand shape many prototypes that were to eventually evolve into what Herb's mind's eye had seen. The Hyperlite. It's not like the others. The Hyperlite is compression molded like a water ski out of epoxy fiberglass and foam. This helps you in a couple of ways. It makes the board more dense and gives it a neutral buoyancy sinkability that makes starting totally easy. Everybody gets up on the hyperlight, usually the first time out. Okay, it took Nathaniel a couple of tries, but he just turned four and he had never skied, surfed, or anything on the water before, and now he's a regular radical wakeboarding dude. Because the hyperlight is built like a ski, it's made thin like a ski, so he can carve up and down the wake like a complete maniac, or even run the slalom course. Hyperlite's foot strap system is extremely comfortable and supportive. It's made of soft neoprene and is adjustable for size and can be switched for goofy foots or regulars quickly and easily. It has soft textured landing pads and stretchy little heel wraps to give more support when you're getting intense air or just learning. You can move the rear strap forward or aft. The Hyperlite has three fins that can be changed around for different kinds of radical moves. Off the lip, on your lips, surface turns, 180s, 360s, slalom, you name it. The board's wide ring it for jumping, then narrows down to wings and a swallow tail for directional stability. Golf balls, of all things, were the inspiration for the little craters you see in the bottom of the hyperlight. We've molded these phasers into the bottom of the board because they trap air underneath the board, making it more maneuverable and softening the landings.